Last season, the Ole Mississippi Rebels shocked the world when they handed the Florida Gators their only loss of the 2008 season. So what can they do for an encore performance here in 2009? We talked to Steelers draft pick Mike Wallace to see exactly what Ole Miss has in the water and what they can do this season. That's not a doubt in my mind. You know, I feel like they they gonna they gonna take it all 12 and 0, 13 and 0 after the SEC championship against Florida. You know, we gonna win that thing. We going all the way. We gonna win the championship. But winning a national championship is much easier said than done. After all, the defending champs reside in their conference. Still, the Rebels return 16 starters from last season, including a rising star quarterback in Jevin Sneed. I think he's a very good quarterback. He was just young last year. Uh, I believe he'll win a Heisman this year. You know, a lot of people might think I'm crazy, but you know, I'm back at Jevin Sneed 100%. I feel like he's going to be NFL ready when it's his time. For Ole Miss and Mike Wallace, the time may be now. One thing they both have going for them are proven leaders on the sideline. In his first year with the Rebels, Houston Nutt found a way to manufacture a nine-win season, a stat he'll look to improve upon in his second year. As for Mike Tomlin, we all know what he did in his second year. I feel like, you know, they, they two are the same kind of people. It's just that Coach uh, Tomlin is maybe like 20 years younger. You know, that's the only difference. You know, they're both laid-back coaches, you know, who, who want their team to get better. You know, they play, both of them are player coaches, and, you know, they, they make you want to play for them. And I, I really, I'm mean, real excited about playing for Coach Tomlin. From St. Vincent College, I'm Justin Downs with Cholester.net, the College Network.